I should have listened to my mom. I shouldn't have had that stupid party. Why did I get drunk? It should have been me. It shouldn't have been them. I should have died. to have a thought of what am I going to do when I'm in that situation so that I don't end up in a morgue or in the police station or make one decision that will forever change your life. It basically gives students a very cool opportunity to tell their peers this is where they stand with drinking and driving. I think that it's a great way for students to be exposed to what could happen, but also parents so that they hear that students need to be calling home asking for a ride rather than taking that chance. We want you to make positive decisions on the weekends at night because when you walk in our doors, you walk in with every decision that you made over the weekend. I think it's showing kids that we care about you more than just the choices you make on a math test. Not only do teenagers, I feel like, have that invincibility, I feel that under the influence that invincibility grows. This is the teenagers, this is what we're dealing with, and this is, this is the reality of, of life. If there's not second chances when you come across a train. Everyone, again, thinks that, you know, what if I have a drink or two, I can drive, nothing bad's gonna happen to me. You know, unfortunately, that's not always the case. People don't realize how many people die in the United States in a given year. Typically we kill about 36,000 people on our roadways. It averages out to, just round it up to about 100 people a day. And of those, a large percentage are intoxicated. But people who die in car crashes, that's me, you, your mom, your dad, your brother, your sister, your spouse. You're driving down the roadway, minding your own business. All of a sudden, here comes a drunk driver, runs a red light, bam, you're dead. One person dies every three hours across America in a railroad-related incident. Again, this was a great opportunity for us to get involved in a program that was already great and, and further enhance it with railroad safety. And that's why the CNs will come out here and produce the crash scene, financially supported the program, and we hope nothing but to expand it in the future.